Hello everyone and welcome to AGG. I am your host Shirogane. Today we'll be playing a uh, a game I found out not that long ago and bought it last Friday. It is a game called School Girls Zombie Hunter. Its premise is not it's pretty much perverted. You'll soon find that out as the trailer comes up, but I bought this on a whim, it was cheaper, and it may get some good videos off of this, so why not? Although, as you can see, I've already played it because this is not the first recording due to the fact that the audio and video were so much mis mix mismatched, I couldn't it couldn't be fixed. And believe me, don't believe the SS rating. I believe anyone would get that at the first level. Because it's just an introductory mission. But from a source, this world is in the Onichichi series, which is... Which I personally have never played, but I do know of it. Being from... The title cover showing a bikini clad samurai girl and I know is that they're a form I think they're a zombie hunter obviously but from I don't remember from what okay what you missed in this beginning scene because I, they just skipped over it since this is my second playthrough of the same mission was uh, a zombie came up to her and tried to attack her and she pulled out a gun out of nowhere I was like what where'd you pull that out of although it seems that these girls aren't your typical average girls obviously because they have a gun for some reason but They all seem to have, they all will seem to have uh, some sort a type of swords they use. Okay. I didn't have that wooden uh, sword in the first playthrough, but it seems like I keep it still. And believe me, uh, first time playing this was a pain because the controls were all mixed. 
jump was R2, aim, uh, actually aim like that was X, run was L1, I believe? No, I don't remember, but I had to alter the control so it could be better play for more over here. Although now I'll probably get a better rating on the second mission. Now I got triple S instead of double. Yeah, if only I could switch her weapon. She's gonna probably keep that pistol throughout the whole game. Hmm, I don't remember what else did I talk about. And I get to finally get those two birds that were missing. This recording is going a lot faster, but this is only going to be a little tease of what the game is going to be about due to the fact... I'll still make this a series, but I... It's not going to be prioritized, that's the only thing. And actually, last time, I did forget to turn on the mic, so... Like, the first three minutes of the original footage was me talking and you hearing absolutely nothing. And then my face going, <gasps> because I realized that I had been talking and none of that has been recorded. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, and the unique, the cool thing is, I did look up uh, who these characters are because since I actually do uh, uh, watch anime and listen and look at their voice actress I'm honestly like I'm not 100% surprised uh, who I'm playing as is not that big but the others I was surprised as because the best known for me, would it probably be none? As the main, uh, as Sayuri, I've seen some of the shows she's been in, or her voice actress. Asaka Ogame, but none of the, like I've seen Heaven's Lost Property, I've seen XL World Infinite Burst, but I don't, have not, although, I don't recall, I didn't really know that she was Lemon Pirate or Diadelis from Heaven's Lost Property. While the rest I just have not seen. Though, on the next one, let me make sure. Yeah, Risa Kubota or this red hair, uh, the one with red dyed, her voice actress Saori Onishi, I have seen. I'm surprised we have Hisako Arato from Food Wars. Vinette April Tsukinose from Gabriel's Dropout and some other ones because I've seen selected infected weak socks the ultimate otaku teacher and she's in Knights of Azure a game I am planning on playing also an anime called Keijo and Monster Musume also Valkyrie Drive that's surprising I'm surprised she's like her and someone else are bigger named voice actress in the anime world. Or like mid. <sighs> They're just more well known because of the characters they play. <sighs> Although some of them have been in similar roles with each other, as I found out. I'll tell you more as we introduce more characters. Yeah, you're gonna see her. She has 
assault rifle and I have this. Completely fair. First, I'm gonna see if I can find the birds. Because I know exactly where to go. Although this game, most people might not like it, due to, it's actually pretty slow pace. It's not quick, just because of mechanics, I guess. But I'm, I'm fine with it. It's not a big deal for me. Huh? Why am I being blocked off? Oh, that's why, because I need to go in here first. Yeah, I can't go in. Uh, if only I could. Although, I wasn't paying attention in the cutscene, but this mission was to go back into the school and get the wooden sword, which I already have. But right now, I'm looking for the two. The two missing birds. Yeah, on some of these I have to open the door by shooting them. Just. Hopefully I'm actually loud enough too, because that's something I did worry about. Wait. Everybody else is there? I'll deal with these guys later. that is. Although, one thing about this game, I wish it didn't give me unlimited ammo. More survival. Probably that's what they did in hard mode. Where are these birds? Uh... Yeah, check this room. Can't go further down. Oh, that was close. <laughs> he fell off. And the birds would be easily to tell which 
ones they are to the fact that uh, they have a red glowing Ah, uh, if only. There's one. We've kind of trapped ourselves now. Uh. I need one more. I wonder where could it be? Mm, no. Because once I go into there, found it. Because once I go in here, it ends the cutscene and that finishes the uh, second mission. Although, this was actually probably well, a shorter. I didn't. From the last recording, it's only about five minutes shorter. Because it took longer. But I will include the. Because there is multiplayer in this game, and I did play it for a bit. I'll show you the first attempt of that. Due to the mechanics of this game, or how, how it's like mm, slow in motion, like not your average. It ain't no Call of Duty. If it was a Call of Duty type of zombie game, oh, it'd have been so much easier to work, but. You'll see once, <laughs> once I put the video up with this at the end of the video. I gotta see. No AED revival. I wonder how you get it B. Probably it's because I let her handle most of the shooting, that's why. Well, this is where I'll end it right now due to the fact. I was only going to play the first two missions and show you a little tease of what this game is about to come. I hope you I hope you guys keep watching. I've been your host, Shirogane, and thanks for watching AGD. See ya. I've been your host, Shirogane, and thanks for watching AGD. See ya. There's a random person I found online. Holy... What?
Wow.